Well, the Republican-led House is going to reconvene today after privately choosing Majority Leader Steve Scalise to be their nominee for Speaker. But as CBS News' Chanel Call reports, Scalise going to need enough support from a divided House to clinch that job. Long live, long live Speaker Scalise. A deeply divided Republican-led House adjourned Wednesday before voting on their new Speaker. Do you think that the Republicans can unite? Yeah. Is Scalise a done deal? Or what do you think? I'm no, kidding? nothing's a done deal until the votes are counted. I've learned that. Majority Leader Steve Scalise narrowly securing his party's nomination, beating Ohio Congressman Jim Jordan 113 to 99 in a private vote. He's seeking to succeed Kevin McCarthy, who was ousted as speaker last week. I think it's a good thing that they got rid of him, honestly. I don't think he supports most of the values that we support. To win, Scalise must have majority support. But short of the 217 votes needed Wednesday, the House chose to recess. It's really, really important that this Congress get back to work. We select a speaker, go to the House floor, get to 218, and then get the House working again. The chamber plans to convene Thursday, but a vote on the speaker isn't yet on the schedule. The new leader must hit the ground running with a federal budget crisis and military aid to Ukraine and Israel hanging in the balance. That position is critical in terms of bringing uh, legislation to the floor and moving things forward. 